hello and welcome back to my channel if you're new here today we are meal prepping with foods that you don't have to go out and buy so hopefully you have a majority of these foods this is something I'm doing about a week after we had actually gotten groceries so kind of using up what's left in my fridge to meal prep just so you recognize and know that you don't have to go buy a whole bunch of new products just to meal prep but you can use things that you maybe have in your pantry or left over in your fridge Today we will be making some overnight oats, some mason jar, salads, and some gut gummies that I use as my daily supplement. Let's get started. So for the overnight oats, you're gonna want four small jars. I have quick oats, vegan um, pea protein powder, cinnamon, chia seeds. I have some cashew milk here, and then some frozen bananas. You can also use two fresh bananas. You're gonna wanna mash them up, but I'm using frozen just because that's what I have. I'm gonna go ahead and pop these in the microwave. How much? All right. All right, so while those are in the microwave, I'm gonna go ahead and do a fourth a cup of one minute quick oats in each container. I'm gonna do a sprinkle of cinnamon. about a teaspoon of chia seeds, one tablespoon of pea protein, a fourth and a half of a fourth, so an eighth, of milk of choice. So now that I have my bananas, I'm gonna go ahead and mash them up and then evenly put them in each container. So then you'll just mix this up. So these are perfect because you can go ahead and put fruit on top of them in the morning, some granola, cacao nibs, maybe some peanut butter or nut butter of choice, and you've got a super easy breakfast. And you can see here too, we have breakfast for the next four days. All right, so now we are going to make mason jar salads. So I really just have what's left over in my fridge and my pantry that I'm gonna put in these jars to use as like a grab and go lunch salad. So I have spinach, cabbage, some pine nuts, cilantro, some cheese, and then garbanzo beans is gonna be my protein source. If you have time, you could also make hard boiled eggs or um, some sort of sliced deli meat, but garbanzo beans is what I'm going to be using. I'm gonna rinse them off, and then I'm gonna do a dressing with apple cider vinegar, lemon, amino acids, coconut amino, sorry, not amino acids, coconut aminos. And then I have some salt, garlic powder, and then this green goddess dressing from Trader Joe's.
Okay, so lastly, we are going to do those bovine gelatin gut gummies. The main ingredient is going to be this bovine gelatin from Perfect Supplements. You can even see here I'm using my leftover juice. So I have cherry juice, a purple power juice, orange juice, and then coconut water. You're going to want to make sure with those juices that they are all 100% natural fruit juice. So like the only ingredient here is going to be tart cherries um, and filtered water. So you want to make sure that is that with your juices. We are going to start by doing two cups of juice um into a stove top dish we're going to put it on the stove top then to to um let it warm up before we add in the other mixture that we're going to do one cup of cherry juice and this will be one cup of this purple power juice they're both from trader joe's use those up i'm a little short so i'll just do a little bit of coconut water all right that in and then this is going to go onto the stovetop on a low temperature it doesn't need to be hot just warm now in our second mix we are going to do three fourths a cup of juice and then a fourth a cup of coconut water so again you can use the same juice i'm only doing this because i want to use up what's in my fridge a third a cup of this bovine gelatin Then you're gonna go ahead and mix this, and then once it's mixed, you're gonna add it to the mixture on the stove top and mix that together. All right, so lastly, you're gonna take some coconut oil and you're just gonna line a dish. Usually an eight by eight is best. I'm using a nine by 13, so they're gonna be a little bit thinner, um, but that's okay. I just, my other dish is dirty, so I'm gonna go ahead and use the nine by 13. All right, so taking that mix that was on your stove top, you're just gonna go ahead and pour this into that dish. And put this in the fridge for about two to three hours, or you can also let them just sit overnight. All right, and there you have it. We prepped overnight oats for four breakfasts worth. We did some gut gummies, also the supplements that I take. They have a good source of collagen, and you've probably heard about them if you follow me on Instagram. And then we also have our mason jar salads. So all of this to prep only takes about 20 minutes. I also just use things that were left over in my fridge, so it's definitely doable to not have to go to the grocery store just to meal prep. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this coming your way or workouts or just lifestyle content. Like always, I'm so thankful for you. So glad that you decided to watch this video and I'll see you next time.